Okay, so I'm going to start this blog post from a slightly different place. I'm going to start by showing you the output. So I'm going to connect to Google Sheets and I'm going to connect to a data set I've just been looking at with my fuel consumption and um, mileage on it. So the instant I connect, uh, I know I need to do some data prep straight away. I don't need um, some of these fields. Um, these two fields here are created in Google Sheets. So I'm actually going to hide them because we're going to do some of our own calculations. And I'm going to use the custom split function just to split out one column which has the date in it. So very, very quickly, I've done some data prep. I'm now ready to do some analysis in, in Tableau. So the other thing I can do while I'm here is uh, this premium tag is is sort of like a, a true or false so I'm, I'm just going to put it here because it really should be a dimension I'm going to drag out the dates and I want the exact date so I can see each day that I actually went to the fuel pump and um, that's the cost so here is a chart showing me the cost uh, how much I've been spending at the fuel tank on each visit over time I started doing this in July and uh, one of the really interesting things is I, I've started analyzing my fuel economy and therefore the performance of my car. And it's been really interesting. So let me just give you a very, very quick example. So I'm just going to divide the cost by the number of miles driven. And uh, what you can see here is if I just drop a reference line into the into the chart with the value, and uh, we actually, you know, format this so that this is a currency. Uh, you can see that the cost uh, on average per mile that I drive is 12, 12 pence. OK, so that's 12 pence per mile. But up here in the 5th of September is actually 20p per mile. So what happened? Essentially, I had an issue with my car. Um, if I just bring out the miles driven underneath that, you can see the actual day where I had the most miles driven was early, uh, mid, late September. I actually had to drive to collect um, my dog from Scotland. So here we have a very, very standout piece of data. And what actually happened here is I had an oil leak. So the engine performance dropped basically through the floor. And um, I, I was able to rescue that, but it was costing me eight pence per mile more than normal compared to my average. And you can see it tends to stay roughly the same. These are sort of peaks and troughs are to do with the type of traffic I'm driving in. So if I do a lot of city driving, it's up high. If I do a lot of motorway driving, it tends to be just below 12 pence. So it's very easy for me to analyze this. And this was all done because Workflow, Google Sheets, and Tableau were able to work together. And for a very, very minimal cost, I have the kind of setup uh, most companies have in a database or data warehouse. And of course, with the new functions in Tableau 10, you can do lots, lots more with that. So that's a very quick insight. Read the rest of the blog post to find out more about how I've actually done this and I'm able to do this kind of analysis. And uh, I'll see you in the next one.